Hey there, Brett Jennings with Real Estate Experts. And what I wanna to talk to you about today is how to move from being just a real estate agent to becoming the CEO of your own real estate business. I've actually transitioned in this journey myself. It took me about three years to really make this move. And I've grown the business from 10 million in production in my first year to over 165 million with 4 million in GCI this last year. So this is a formula that works. It all starts with a concept that my first mentor introduced to me. At the time I sold about 15 homes in a year and he had sold 300 homes in a year. He said, Brett, you know, the reason most agents just don't push past 15 or 20 homes is they suffer from something called EID, entrepreneurial idiot disease. <laughs> I said, what's that? He says, well, the problem, Brett, is that 80% of real estate is just 20 to $25 an hour work, okay? And if you relegate yourself to doing all of that work, meeting inspectors at properties, putting flyers in flyer boxes, then you're only gonna have 20% of your time to make this $200 an hour plus, okay? Now, the other thing we wanna understand in this equation for you is what is your time worth? First, figuring out what's your income goal? Let's say, for example, your income goal is to make 500,000 a year. Well, what's your time worth? Assuming you work a 40 hour week, 50 weeks a year, you would then divide that by 2,000 hours, 40 hours, 50 weeks, your time is now worth $250 an hour. So therefore, anything that's not worth $250 an hour should not be on your plate. So that's the first concept to understand. And thereby, we start to introduce this principle of leverage. And that's actually getting other people to work for you. Now, I wanna outline for you kind of where we're gonna go as you grow from agent to CEO. This is time, this is money. And this is the trajectory of an awesome growing real estate business when you're going from agent to CEO. There's three things that we need to put in place to really grow this business. The first is an awesome admin staff. We talked about over here getting leverage on your time. And so we're gonna do that through, the first point is through administrative staff. That's gonna be once in the beginning, you're gonna start leveraging that through transaction coordinators. Once you're between 15 and 20 transactions, you're gonna to wanna to hire a full-time admin, okay? The second thing that we need before we can bring to go from agent to CEO and really start building a team is predictable, scalable lead generation, okay? That's gonna be right here. This is lead gen. Now, most agents only utilize open houses and sphere of influence, and so they never really develop enough lead generation to support a team, to really grow from agent to CEO. The things that you're gonna look at are farming and online to grow this lead generation engine. If you get a kick butt admin team and you got awesome lead generation, more than you can support yourself, then you're ready to really become the CEO and start adding agents. Okay, and that's what also will make agents loyal to you because you're helping drive business for them. So that's how we go from agent to CEO. If you wanna get more information, click on the link for this video. Hope that was helpful. This is Brett Jennings saying, don't just be the agent, be the expert.